Well, city councilors in Providence have unanimously approved a resolution with the goal of ending all traffic deaths and serious injuries by the year 2030. So it's an ambitious goal, obviously. 12 News reporter Kristen Burnell joining us live with how they plan on doing this and how it's already working right now in another U.S. city. Kate and Patrick, this comes after three people have been killed in the city in the past year and several others have been seriously injured due to several hit and run incidents. Now, last night, city councilors were emotional when speaking about the deaths that have occurred on North Main Street. I ask you all to help me support this to make our streets safer for all of our residents, for drivers, for walkers, for bikers, for scooters and for people who are all of those things. We are all those at all different times. The initiative titled Vision Zero is an agreement and commitment to redesign city streets to become more safe for all residents. Councilors also spoke about how they are taking serious steps to change city streets, including working with the mayor's office to implement common sense. Best practice programs, including securing outside funding to create safe transportation for all. City councilors used Hoboken, New Jersey as an example that has not had a single traffic death in several years. The mayor of Hoboken spoke out back in 2020 you about their initiative. In the last four consecutive years, we're one of the only few cities in the country to have zero traffic related deaths. A ceremony committing to the Vision Zero initiative is set to take place next Wednesday on North Main Street. Reporting live in Providence this morning, Kristen Burnell, 12 News.